A group of Bay Area high school students are being recognized for creating a device that detects gunshots in schools and then sends out alerts. KTV's LaMonica Peter joins us live from San Jose with more about the students in tech and how they're hoping to make an impact on school campuses. LaMonica? Education Week says that since May, there have been 24 school shootings that involve injuries and death. And these students say they created this device based on their own experiences being on lockdown, and they believe it can help save students' lives. We've all experienced school shooting scares um, at our high schools, and so it was kind of a no-brainer to approach a problem like this. Caitlin Nguyen, Swana Srivastava, Audrey Wang and Rebecca Wang all attend different high schools throughout the Bay Area, but after meeting at local tech competitions, they started working on a new project. This outer casing is 3D printed and it holds a microphone right here that captures the surrounding audio um, to determine whether there has been a gunshot or not. And data from the microphone um, goes inside our motherboard right here where it processes the data. It processes the data um, to determine whether there's been a gunshot. When gunshots are detected, a text message is sent to students and staff with the location based on which sensor is triggered on campus. Police will also receive an automated phone call with the information. The team says it spent about $90 creating this prototype. Some parents in San Jose met with district leaders last month to voice their concerns after multiple emergency lockdown situations and a ghost gun being confiscated at Willow Glen High School. Our goal really was to make it so that it's just something not noticeable and it doesn't like interfere with a regular school uh, day because smoke detectors are everywhere and no one really notices them and they don't get in the way of anything. Meanwhile, the team has been contemplating their next move after entering their project in NASA's Conrad Challenge, competing against over 950 student teams from around the world. They were given the Pete Conrad Scholars Award, which includes $7,000 in scholarships to the TKS Global Innovation Program. So there were like teachers, mentors, judges, and you know many people, and they really supported this our, our solution and they really want to see Siren become a real thing. The team says they're looking for funding to complete the prototype of the gunshot detector and they're also looking for mentors in machine learning who can help them perfect it. Mike? LaMonica Peters live tonight in San Jose. LaMonica, thank you. The Uvalde Foundation for Kids says it is recognizing the high school students with its National Student Hero Awards. They will be honored for creative innovation and dedication to ending school violence. The foundation was formed after last year's mass shooting at Robb Elementary School that left 19 children and two adults dead.